Hi, in this video I'm going to show you a quick way to do Pareto analysis. One way using a pivot table and the second way using a chart. So for those that are not familiar with the word Pareto, it's basically based on the Pareto principle or the 80-20 rule. For example, 20% of the population controls or is responsible for 80% of the wealth. It's that kind of concept when we talk about the 80-20 rule. So also at the end of the video, I'll have links to other Pareto videos and the different approaches you can take. So stick around. So here I got a small table and if I want to do Pareto analysis on it, I would have to kind of sort this table and figure out the 80%. And that'd be a lot of input into other cells. But what I can do here is just go to insert, insert pivot table, and let's put it on this sheet here. Click OK and pull in the data. I have my product here. I have my revenue here. And for a quick analysis to figure out which products account for 80% of all the revenues, I can just look at value filters and do a top 10 here. And let's do top 80% my revenue. Click OK. And it tells me the items that are responsible for 80%. So this is not 20, this is not 20 percent of these because we, as, as we know we've got 10 products here but it tells you which products account for 80 percent right so that's in line with that concept now if we wanted to find out how this could be done with a chart let's close this window here I can just click into my range here insert go to chart and under the statistics chart we have a histogram and this is what we want. This is our Pareto chart. It's available in Excel versions 2016 and up. So if you have anything previous in that, and again, at the end of this video, there'll be links to other videos that show you how to do it if you don't have this version. So click on this chart and we have our Pareto chart. So it kind of tells you that the bulk of it, where we have our 80% cutoff here, these are these products, one, two, three, four, five, which accounts for these five here. Let me stretch this out so you can see this a little bit better. And this is something where you can put a chart title here, get rid of the grid lines, make it look pretty, but that's the chart way of doing it. So if you want to do some really quick Pareto analysis, uh, these are the two ways that you can do it. So I hope that helps. Thanks for watching.